Hey Thomas, how are you? Troy Brown here with TLC Web Marketing. And I uh, wanted to get this screencast off to you, my friend. Sorry it took a few days longer than I figured. Um, I hope you are well and hopefully you are in the rebuilding process after everything you've been through here for the last 7 to 10 days. So I wanted to get this over to you so we could take a look at your business and what we can do to bring you in leads. You had mentioned that you had about 63 leads last year um, from this uh, GMB site. So um, obviously this is just your GMB. You don't have a regular website and this has been doing pretty well for you. Um, good job, you know, posting some things, putting in offers, making posts. Um, you've done very well with this. And then you got your testimonials here. So um, you're doing a great job of using your GMB to promote your business. However, it is very limited um, beyond the, the GMB. Um, so with that said, I'm going to talk about three things today that are the primary th top three things that Google looks at in order to rank your website in the first page of the organic search. You already know about the GMB we just talked about, but let's just take a quick look. Um, I did Tree Services Brighton, Colorado. You were still in the top three of the map pack. Then I did Tree Trimming Brighton, and you're in the very top of the first one, which is always good. Get your name of your business, phone number, everything, website connection. Um, the other ones there are Riverdale Tree Service and Kelly Tree Service. So I went ahead and took a look uh, here at the organic search too. So your top competition is Colorado Tree Service Pros. Then you've got Yelp, Thumbtack, Lawn Starters. Those are all um, services or directories. Then Home Advisor, Home Advisor. Next one, competition. Second, Riverdale Tree Services. And then number three is Save a Tree. After that, you got Thornton Creek Tree Services and BrightonCo.gov, which is interesting. City of Brighton. Um, they're talking about requiring licensing. So that is your competition, my friend, in Brighton specifically. We could always expand upon that. Um, but what I did was is I went ahead and took the top three. So again, you've got John Eager's Tree Service, and their URL is Colorado Tree Service Pros. You've got Save a Tree, and then you've got Riverdale Tree Service. Okay, now, and then we've got your yours right here. So I went ahead and took all of these websites. This is yours first, and I put them in this tool called Arifs, and it pretty much takes a look and you can see all the internal workings of a website. So interestingly enough, this, the UR, is your popularity and the DR is the strength of your website. So this is one of the very highest I've I've seen with the strength of your website and the only reason it's this high is because it's Google. Um, it, you know, taking a look at other people's site. Okay, so just so you know, backlinks, organic keywords, it's not showing anything here. Okay, but your competition, 18 and 1, 68 backlinks, 682 organic keywords. So, again, I'm talking about three things today. Content, citations, and backlinks. So let's touch on content real quick. If I go through your site and I copy and paste everything out of here, you actually have some, some good content on your GMB website. But if we do a count, you are right at 796 words. Believe it or not, Google wants to see 1,500 words or more, even if it's their own website. That'll really help your ranking, okay, along with the description of your business being optimized. Um, so that's what I recommend on the GMB is add another, another 600, 800 words so that you're up above that 1,500. And then optimize your description of your business here. And that'll go a long way towards helping you aside from you know having your own website obviously so again this is how your website looks when Google's looking at it and that 92 right there is why you're number one in the map pack but you are not ranking individually for that um, in the top 30 listings okay so you can see that uh, we just saw this 682 organic keywords with 68 backlinks 51 backlinks 
62 keywords, okay, number two position. Number three position here for Save a Tree. And this is interesting. So Save a Tree is a national company and they tree care, lawn service, Thornton, and then they also have Brighton in here in their description. So you can see their popularity is 11, very strong website at 58. But if we break this down for the local, they only have one backlink and 27 keywords. And that's because this is a local, this is a local search. So here's the opportunity, my friend, is that with not too much effort, you can actually outrank one and two position without much of a problem. You'd have to get your own website up and get the proper backlinks and organic keywords in there, but you could come up pretty quickly and pass these guys because there's not a lot of really strong, strong competition. Um, even if we look here at the organic keywords, um, tree server, let's go back here. So your backlinks can be anything that points to your website from another website. So um, uh, it can be anything from a blog, an article, a directory. And the listings in a directory would be a citation, which is actually, if we just do Yardmaster, your name, address, phone number, that's a citation. So this information here and how it appears in Google specifically is exactly how they want you to have it out there in the world. So that's a citation. A citation is a type of a backlink. It's just not a real powerful backlink. But um, a blog post, an article, a um, any kind of a guest post would carry much more power than a citation. So those are my recommendations, my friend. Um, feel free to, to use all of these techniques on this uh, Google My Business website. might help you out um, and get you, you know, anchor you there even more. You can also expand your services that you offer um, if you want to do, you know, yard mowing, that kind of thing. But it looks like you're pretty much committed to doing the tree service, which is a really strong service. So I hope all this helps. Feel free to use all these. If you have any questions, feel free to get back to me. Thanks so much, Thomas.